Alright, welcome back everyone to another Tech Zone video. And today I'm going to be showing you how to upgrade your PSP custom firmware from 5.00 M33-6 to 5.50 Gen dash A and then dash B. So here are the two updates. This is dash A which is 26 MB and dash B which is 190 KB. The reason why Gen B is 190 KB, KB is because since your PSP is already 5.50 Gen, what's the point downloading the official firmware again? Now as, as I was saying, you need 5.00 M33-6 in order to update to this, so if you have 5.00 M33 or below, upgrade it and then upgrade to uh, 5.00 M33-6. Now, to install it, so here is dash A, so we have here is the PSP folder. So I'm going to go to my computer, you're going to put the PSP in USB mode, make sure your battery is 78-75% percent. so I believe, no, this is dash A, yeah that's dash A, I'm going to copy it in there, yes, yes, just gonna copy all the items. Move and replace. Oh yeah, one more thing. I think I uh, forgot to delete my previous. Uh, no, no. Okay, never mind. Okay, so that was dash A. So we can close that, and now we can copy the dash B folders. Yes, we can copy that as well. So let's just copy all that. I think it's done. Yep, it's done. So let's just go in there and see what are the files. Oh, here, 5.50 Gen B update. And now we're ready. But before doing anything, here's a recommended step. Highly recommended. I'll go to my documents folder, new, backup. And we're gonna back up our save games because the, sometimes they can be corrupted. So PSP, save data. We're going to copy all of them. Copy. Paste. It's 10 MB. Okay, so now that we have copied our save games, now we can proceed with the update. Okay, so now that we're done, I'm going to cancel USB mode. I'm going to remove the USB cable. Now what you are going to do, just to show you that it is, as you can see 5.00 M33-6 and then we're going to the memory stick. Now here is dash A and there's dash B. So we had to go to dash A first. Oh yeah, the battery. Make sure your battery is 80% of higher. I have 94, so that's okay. This is a PSP 1000 model. Make sure you have either the PSP 1000 or the 2000 models, or the fat or slim, not the 3000 or the go. So let's run Gen A. Yeah, I messed up with the, you know, uh, boot logo files and got messed up. So press X to start the update. Press X. Starting the updater. Should run the update any moment. There you are, system firmware version 5.50. Start. So, next. Accept. Yeah. X to start. So as you can see, it is updating. I don't know how long it's going to take. I'll just show you the whole process just to be sure.
Okay, so as you can see, it's done. You have to press X to restart. Right, we are back on. Let's take a look what it's done. There you go, 5.50 Gen A full. Now to Gen B. This is probably the easiest part. Go to the Gen B update. It's updating on its own. You don't have to do anything. Done with success. Yay. And we're done. Let's take a look. Easy as that. No need to worry. Gen B. Now just to make sure that my save data is okay. Otherwise I don't have to do that again. Oh, everything's okay. So that backup was optional. So yeah, that's about it. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, why don't you subscribe for more. So thanks for watching, and have a great day.